Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello. I'm so happy y'all here. Um, today's vlog is going to be basically me getting ready for my New York City trip. Um, I'm just going to be showing you the little things I do for my external appearance to make myself look a little bit better, feel a little bit more confident. Um, yeah, that's that. I'm so excited to go. I'm so excited to go. I go tomorrow. I can't wait. I can't wait. Okay. Enjoy the vlog. Like if you want to. Subscribe if you want to. If you don't. <laughs> I understand. Um, but I hope you're having a great day. Let's get into it. Hi, you guys. I just got home from the mall. I went to Zara. I have literally never been to Zara before, you guys. I don't know why because I literally could have bought everything in the store. Um, obsessed. New favorite store. Period. Sorry I'm late to the game, but Zara, hey, what's good? Um, obsessed. I obviously need some fits for New York. Um, I have a few outfits planned out already, but I still needed a few more. So we went to Zara, we got some goodies. I'm gonna do a little try on haul for you guys. Let's get into it. Like, I'm sorry, but even the bag is just so aesthetically pleasing. Like, why? All right, first things first, I got this pink just buttoned down. I'm not sure how I wanna style it yet. But I'm thinking, you know, with some boxer shorts and then some, like, cute kicks. Um, or, like, have, like, something underneath and keep it, like, open. It's going to be really hot when I'm there. So, I don't know how long I'm going to be able to wear this for. But definitely was obsessed with the color. And I just love this color. I needed a pink button down. So, here we are. <laughs> You guys, I'm so sad. This literally looks so cute on the hanger. I like don't even want to show you, but if you're 5'1 and I don't know, I feel like maybe just, I, I it just doesn't work. Um, Kimmel Toe situation is just not, not it. Um, and I just, I feel like I'm, I belong in a circus wearing this, so. We'll not be wearing this to New York City. We'll be returning. You guys. When I tell you, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh. This is the best dress I've ever worn. Like, you have no idea. It's very hard for me to find dresses as a 5'2 person. <laughs> Like, especially not trying on a dress and then buying it. Like, I don't really do that. But I just felt good about this one. I got an extra small. The color, the fit, it's silky, it's soft. I will be wearing this in New York City. This is a moment right here. Wow. I'm sexy and I know it. Look at me go. No, seriously, you guys. Like, look at that back, too. Oh, matched with my planty. I'm just a big open back girl. Like, that's like, I used to wear these types of dresses when I was, like, literally 12. They were, like, my go-to dress. And we're having, we're having that moment again. I'm just, I'm obsessed. Like, look at that color. Look at that color and that design. I'm a green zebra. That's what's going on. I'm a green zebra. I'm sorry, but like, why is Zara the best store ever? Why am I just hearing about Zara? Why have I not shopped there ever? <laughs> like, I don't know. I feel like maybe it's because my style has really changed the past few years. I don't know, but I'm so happy I went. First of all, let's just start with this top, okay? We love a green top. We love a green top. We love the design up here, like, if for the flat for my flatty itty bitties, we love tops that just cover it up, nothing to see. It's all right, um, and we just yeah, I like it. I love it. This skirt situation is so cute. You can like adjust it up here. Love the color. It's flowy. It's vibey. 
We love it. I love it. I will be wearing, I don't know this combo, but I will be wearing this in New York City. Alrighty guys, I don't know how I feel about these shorts. I just don't know. I feel like I'm someone who doesn't like the short shorts anymore that ride up your butt. Like, I'm just not about that anymore. But I'm also not about like the super long shorts. I need like a mediocre size. This, I feel like, like they're cute. I just need to style it better maybe. This has potential. I might keep it. Um, I wish it had pockets, no pockets, but I do love the color. I just don't know if I like the way it fits on me. Oh, we love being short. But guys, can we just talk about this top again? I'm sorry. I'm just, it's the open back for me. Just call me an open back knot. Open back knot. All right, that's my Zara haul. Literally, like, six things. I don't even know, but I'm super happy I went. I'm definitely going to be going a lot more. Those are some of my fits for NYC. <laughs> Hot girl glow up number two or number three is going to the beach and getting a tan. The sunshine is just so healing for so many different ways and you always just feel so much more confident when you're a shade or two darker. Am I right? I feel so alive right now. <laughs> Hot girl summer Good ready. Good morning, bestie. <laughs> it's probably like my double chin. <laughs> Dude, Hot girl summer it's baby. It's okay. We're, we're getting all the angles yeah. here. Up, down, all around. <laughs> Hi guys. It is currently 11.28. I'm really late for my lash appointment, but I'm just going to say this now before I forget because I need a little before and after. Um, so I'm getting my lashes done today. You guys, if you've been following me since the summer, you know I love me some lashes. They just give me an extra boost of confidence. I usually get them in the summer. It's it's June now, baby. So we we celebrating. We're going to treat ourselves. We're going to go get some lashes. Um, the reason why I love lashes on me is because my, uh, um, the reason why I love getting lashes is because I naturally have like really long eyelashes, but they're very thin. And when I get lash extensions, they just add more like, um, volume and like eye shape. And it's so nice, like, not having to worry about mascara. I hate mascara. Like, actually hate it. Like, the biggest reason I get extensions is so that I don't have to worry about the mascara and just wake up and not worry about that part because it literally takes me, like, 20 minutes to just get them, like, volumized. We're just going for the extensions, and I'm super excited. So, okay, let's go. You guys, I totally forgot to show you my lashes after I got them done. Um, it's been about a week now. I apologize. I literally am the u worst YouTuber ever. I'm, I'm learning. <laughs> um, but yeah, these are my lashes. I'm obsessed with them. Literally, I didn't realize how much I miss having lashes. Like... Just being able to wake up and like have these babies on, not worry about mascara, just like, I literally don't wear makeup when I have lashes, like, it's the lashes for me, the lashes are the makeup, we're done, we're done here, so, very happy with them, and happy I treated myself to some lashy washies. Hi guys, good morning, it is 11.44. I am getting my hair done today. Um, so excited. It's been a few months since I've gotten my hair done. I went blonde not too long ago, like three months ago, but you see my roots are setting in and I just need a retouch. I'm probably gonna go a shade lighter for summer because I miss my blonde. I miss blonde not. Like I just feel like happiest when I'm blonde. Um, it brings out a different side of me, you know, so yeah, so very excited to get my hair done I will bring you guys along with me Let's go <laughs> Hi you guys, alrighty another little glow up situation in situation in 
Nice. Another little glow up um, treat before New York is I'm going to get my nails refilled. These girlies are getting a bit long and I just need a full set. So let's do it. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. It's going to be a surprise. Um, I like to just think of it as I go. Whatever color speaks to me in that moment, I'm like, let's do it. I'm very intuitive with my nail choices so we'll see but i love these but this girly we gotta fix her up so let's do a little before and after <laughs> Here are the new nails. I decided to get green because we doing a green vibe for New York City. That's what I said. That's what feels right. Also, can we just take a moment? Do you guys remember my old room where I would do all my old TikToks? I'm here for the weekend because my cousin just had a grad party. So it's definitely weird being back here because it's literally empty. Um, but yeah, that's why I'm here. Alrighty, here she is. We're gonna open her up, do a little unboxing. Let's go. Alright, let's get it. Oh, I'm literally terrible at this. Muscle. Oh my gosh, Teddy Blake, New York. Guys, I'm so excited right now. Double wrap, she triple wrap. Wow, comes a little, with a little baggie. Oh my gosh, the color you guys. All right, before I take the bag out, I want you to comment down what color you think I got. I'm honestly going for a little theme for this trip. My aura is. You know, you know, comment down below, but here we go. Here's the big reveal. What color I got. Oh my gosh, it literally looks beautiful. Oh my gosh, how cute. You wanna see? <gasps> wow. Wow. You guys. So she's a dark green. Kind of like a forest green type, but green is just like what I'm attracting in New York. I got my nails green, got um, a lot of my outfits will be green. I just... I'm digging green right now. Okay, there's not many trees in New York. We're bringing the forest to New York City. I am bringing the green to New York City. Um, so that's why this purse caught my eye. I just love the material the color i love how it's like not too big not too small i'm not a huge like handbag type person so this is like super just like cute and handy i love like just like how compact and i will put my chopsticks in here wallet all the little maybe some snackies if you know me you know we get hangry i'm gonna be hangry on my trip for sure so i'm gonna put some snackies in there but just like look how cute like look there's a little zipper in the back we got the teddy blake logo i love like the snake skin material it's just it's beautiful it's gorgeous this is definitely one of the nicest bags i have Teddy Blake is a sponsor of today's video. Thank you so much. I'm so excited to wear this, not even in just New York City, but literally everywhere. Um, one of the nicest bags I have for sure. All Teddy Blake's bags are designed with luxurious leather from Italy, dyed and treated to withstand a test of time while maintaining a luxurious look. Another reason why I love Teddy Blake is because you get a luxurious handbag without the $1,000 to $2,000 label. They make everything at a more fair price rather than some other brands that are obviously a little bit more expensive. So these are just more in my budget right now. Um, but yeah, and you get the same, you know, luxurious feel. Like I feel like I'm, I feel like a million bucks, period, with this bag. Um, 
Another thing I love about Teddy Blake is they never compromise on quality. They're using the same exquisite materials as any other luxury brand and using it for themselves and at a lower price. So we love that. Me on my, on my way to the gym like... Teddy Blake? Teddy Blake. Yeah. <laughs> You guys, I love, I love it. I love it. And you can also go like this if I want. <gasps> That's cute too. You guys will definitely be seeing this bag on my Insta. Um, follow my Instagram if you're not already. Natalia Seliger is my like personal where I'm doing more fashion related stuff. But if you want to also follow my wellness, which you probably already are, if you're subscribed. Um, do that. I will put them in the description box. Also, I forgot to show you guys my hair. I swear. Why do I forget literally to vlog anything? Um, this is my new hair. It's basically the same thing. I fixed the roots because they were getting a little dark, so I just brought it up a little bit. Um, it's gonna get lighter as the summer goes on. As the summer. As the summer goes on. Um, but I just wanted... A little touch up, a little trim trim. Hi you guys, I'm so excited. I leave to New York City tomorrow. Um, I'm just finishing up some errands at home. I'm still in Orange County and then I'm driving home later to LA to pack and get ready. But yeah, I'm just like, whoa, I'm actually going to New York. Like it's finally happening. You guys, I have not traveled, like been on a plane since before COVID. So I'm just like so excited and ready. And honestly, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I got a bit emotional this morning just because my life has just changed so much this past year and the fact that I'm just like going to New York City tomorrow, you know, with my best friends, a whole new group of friends and like, you know, I'm uh, collaborating with this hotel and collaborating with a few restaurants and it's just like it's crazy how much of my life has changed in a year and it's a lot to like fully take in and this is like the first trip I'm ever going on with like you know social media being my full-time job so it's just like it's a lot of newness but it's like very exciting and I'm just so grateful like the amount of gratitude I have in my heart right now is like just overflowing like I'm just so thankful so grateful that I have this opportunity it's just like life is crazy like I just can't believe how much my life has changed in a year, especially like being home and like remembering how my life used to be like being home can kind of be triggering for me sometimes just because Orange County is all I know and like I didn't have the best time here all the time. So coming back home, it's kind of hard sometimes, but thankful that my life has changed the way it did and I did the work to get there and I believed in myself and this is just a reminder that if you have a goal, if you have just any aspiration, you have a dream, go for it, period, go for it, because I never believed in myself. I never thought I would be in the position I am today, and I'm only gonna, you know, keep going up. I'm not gonna, we're done, we're, we're, we're past that, we're going up only. Um, so it's just amazing. It's like good now to come back here and be like, yeah, like I did that. Like I I didn't give up on myself. I kept going. Um, so yeah, I just want to share that with you guys because I got very emotional this morning. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe because I'm going to be vlogging the whole entire time in New York City. You guys, I'm so excited. I love you. I hope you're having a great day. I just want to say thank you for being here once again. Thank you for your support. I would not be going on this trip without your guys' support. Like, literally would not be going on this trip. So, I'm just very appreciative, forever thankful, forever blessed. I love you. We'll see you next time.